Is it time to buy or sell QQQ ETF? In this video, we're diving deep into QQQ. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, the 20th of August, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive a free price prediction and in-depth analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since the 14th of August, 2024, our system has identified QQQ as a buy candidate, assigning it a score of 1.49. Now let's examine the stock's performance during this time frame. The stock has experienced a gain of 3.79%. This equates to an average return of 0.76% each day since it was designated as a buy candidate. The exchange-traded fund is currently moving within a broad and horizontal trend, and we can anticipate further movements within this same trend. Analyzing the three-month trend indicates a slight potential change of approximately negative 0.0486% over the upcoming three months, with a possible return ranging from negative 9.52% to positive 4.65%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it points to a change of 33.68% over the next year, with a potential return between 22.32% and 44.20%. This would correspond to a price range of approximately $587.46 to $692.52 after one year. Our latest daily update for QQQ includes the headline, QQQ ETF upgraded from hold accumulate to buy candidate after Tuesday trading session. The QQQ ETF price experienced a decline of 0.21% on the last day, Tuesday, the 20th of August, 2024, falling from $481.27 to $480.26. During the last trading day, the ETF fluctuated by 0.92%, ranging from a low of $478.55 to a high of $482.94. Remarkably, the price has risen in eight of the last 10 days, showing an increase of 9.27% over the past two weeks. Trading volume surged on the last day by 10 million shares, albeit alongside falling prices. This could serve as an early warning sign, indicating a slight increase in risk over the next few days. In total, 28 million shares were exchanged, amounting to approximately $13.66 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of the ETF reached $503.52, while the lowest price was $342.35. Currently, the price stands 4.62%, or $23.26, below the 52-week high of $503.52, which also represents the all-time high for the ETF. The Invesco QQQ Trust Exchange Traded Fund has recently experienced a sell-off. However, this situation may offer a unique opportunity for investors with a focus on artificial intelligence. As a prominent player in the technology sector, QQQ encompasses numerous leading stocks in AI, which have historically provided solid returns. The increased interest from significant investors, including Ken Griffin, who has notably raised his stake in QQQ, highlights confidence in the ETF, especially as the AI boom continues to evolve. Despite a recent decline in the NASDAQ 100 index, attributed to losses in semiconductor stocks, market analysts indicate that a rebound could be on the way. Companies such as Nvidia and Broadcom may reignite interest, potentially enhancing QQQ's performance in both the short and long term. Engaging in growth-focused investments through QQQ enables investors to diversify their portfolios while accessing high-growth sectors. 
This strategy presents the possibility of exceptional returns and positions them favorably against traditional value stocks. The influx of capital into various exchange-traded funds reflects a sustained interest in growth sectors, supporting a strong outlook for QQQ. Looking ahead, the long-term prospects for QQQ remain promising, particularly if spending on AI continues its upward trend. This positions QQQ as not only a strategic investment today, but also an appealing choice for those aiming to achieve significant gains by the time they reach retirement. The following signals have been identified for QQQ. The QQQ Exchange Traded Fund holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive outlook for the stock. However, the ETF also shows a general sell signal based on the relationship between these two averages, as the long-term average is above the short-term average. During downward corrections, there will be support at $469.67 and $472.35. A breakdown below either of these levels will trigger sell signals. Additionally, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. However, some negative signals have also emerged and may impact near-term developments. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Monday, August 19, 2024, and so far, it has decreased by 0.21%. Further declines are expected until a new bottom pivot is identified. Yesterday, volume increased alongside decreasing prices, which may serve as an early warning, suggesting that the ETF should be monitored more closely. Here are some additional signals that may be of interest. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, sell signal from two days ago, Bollinger, buy signal from 12 days ago, short-term moving average, buy signal from nine days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal from five days ago, the relationship between the short and long moving averages, buy signal from 21 days ago. When examining the 12-month chart, we observe, short moving average, buy signal from seven days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal from seven days ago, the relationship between the short and long moving averages, buy signal from 187 days ago. For more signals, please visit our page at stockinvest.us. Let's discuss the support, risk, and stop loss for QQQ. On the downside, the Exchange Traded Fund, or ETF, find support just below today's level, stemming from accumulated volume at $448.75 and $439.53. There is an inherent risk when an ETF is testing a support level. If this level is breached, the ETF may then decline to the next support level. In this scenario, QQQ has support just below today's level at $448.75. Should this level be broken, the subsequent support from accumulated volume will be at $439.53 and $435.37. This ETF typically exhibits average movements throughout the day, and with good trading volume, the risk is deemed to be medium. Over the past day, the ETF fluctuated by $4.39 between its high and low, which represents a change of 0.92%. Over the last week, the ETF has shown a daily average volatility of 1.29%. Before we dive into the potential favorable trading levels for QQQ, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, we have the price to earnings ratio, commonly known as the PE ratio. This important metric measures a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. A relatively low P.E. ratio may indicate either low expectations for the company's future or that the stock is undervalued, which could signal a potential buying opportunity. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for QQQ. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for QQQ is at $481.77. If you don't own any shares, it might be wise to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, QQQ encounters its first support level 
at $448.75. If this support level holds, it could present a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. Our recommended stop loss is set at $466.11, reflecting a decline of 2.95%. This exchange-traded fund exhibits medium daily fluctuations, indicating a medium level of risk. Additionally, a sell signal has been generated from a pivot top identified nine days ago. Is QQQ ETF a good buy? Several short-term signals appear positive, suggesting that the current level may present a buying opportunity. There is a reasonable chance for QQQ ETF to perform well in the near future. Our analysis has shifted from a hold or accumulate recommendation to a buy candidate. Upon reviewing the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Wednesday, the 21st of August, we anticipate that QQQ will open higher by approximately 32 cents, starting trading at $480.58. It is important to remember that trading carries a significant risk of financial loss. Therefore, it is advisable to consult a financial advisor before making any decisions regarding the purchase or sale of securities. Your investment choices should not be solely based on the information provided by stockinvest.us. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge your responsibility for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for the exchange traded fund? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.